الحمد لله الذي من على عباده بمواسم الخيرات ليغفر لهم بذلك الذنوب ويكفر عنهم سيئات ويضاعف لهم بذلك الثواب ويرفع لهم درجات وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وزوجاته الطاهرات وعلى أصحابه الأولي الهمم العاليات وتابعين ومن تبعهم بإحسان اليوم تبعث الباريات أما بعد أحبت في الله والحمد لله we reach the holy month of Ramadan and very important that we benefit during this Ramadan and remind one another about the various benefits of Ramadan and the khair and how to benefit from this Ramadan and one of the things which is very important to know about the beginning of Ramadan in the hadith the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said إِذَا كَانَ أَوَلَ اللَّيْلَ مِنْ شَرَ رَمَضَانِ مِنْ شَرَ رَمَضَانِ سُفِدَتَ الشَّيَاطِينَ وَمَرْدَتَ الْجِنَّ وَغُلِقَتْ أَبْوَابَ النَّارِ فَلَمْ يُفْتَحْ مِنْهَا بَابٍ وَفُتِحَتْ أَبْوَابَ الْجَنَّةِ فَلَمْ يُغْلِقْ مِنْهَا بَابٍ وَيُنَادِ مَنَادِ كُلُّ اللَّيْلِ يَا بَاغِي الْخَيْرِ أَقْبَلْ وَيَا بَاغِي الشَّرْ أَقْصَرْ وَلِلَّهِ إِتْقَى مِنَ النَّارِ وَذَلِكَ كُلُّ اللَّيْلِ The Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم said He said that when it comes to the first night in the holy month of Ramadan the shayateen, the devils, are shackled. You know what shackled means? Yeah, it means they put chains on them. The devils are shackled. And the jinn are repelled. The jinn are scared away. And the doors of the hellfire are closed. And the doors of paradise are open. And not one of those doors of Jannah will be closed. And then there will come someone who, a caller, who calls every single night of Ramadan. And they say, Ya Bari al Khair. They say, Oh, you who wants to do good. Do good. You know, accept, do, do this good. Do good. And they say, oh you person who does evil, refrain from your evil. So Ramadan is the time to stop doing the bad things if you have bad habits and strive to do the good things. And Allah, every, uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He frees people from the fire during those nights, every night. And in another hadith, وَقَالَ صَلَى اللَّهُ عَلَيْهِ وَسَلَّمْ أَتَاكُمْ شَرْ رَمَضَانِ شَرْ مُبَارَكِ فَرَضَ اللَّهُ عَلَيْكَمْ صِيَامُهُ تُفْتَحُ فِيهِ أَبْوَابَ السَّمَاءِ وَتُغْلِقُ فِيهِ أَبْوَابَ الْجَحِيمِ وَتَغَلْ فِيهِ مَرْدَةَ شَيَاطِينِ وَفِيهِ اللَّيْلَ هِيَ خَيْرْ مِنْ أَلْفْ شَهْرْ مِنْ حُرِمَ خَيْرَهَا فَقَدْ حُرِمْ the Prophet Sallallahu said in a hadith that is a hadith in uh, Sahahu Shaykh al-Albani, Imam al-Albani, in Sahih al-Nisai. The Prophet Sallallahu said, the month of Ramadan comes to you and it is a blessed month. And Allah has made fasting an obligation upon you. And the doors of the heavens are opened. And the doors of hell are closed. And the devils, the transgressing devils, are shackled. 
And during it, meaning during this month, is a night which is better than a thousand months. Whoever is prohibited from its good, then they're prohibited. Meaning whoever didn't get tofik from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, whoever wasn't blessed to make, to stay up and make qiyam al layl and pray to Allah and cry to Allah and make repentance to Allah and supplicate to Allah on the layl of the qadr, you know, the night of power, then if they missed it, halas, they missed it. You're only going to get one chance during this Ramadan for that. Bi'idnillah. So it lets us know that this is a time to do good. The shayateen are shackled. Uh, and Allah gives tawfiq or blesses those people who do good to, to have done the good. And those people who didn't, then they miss that because of their own selves. Because of their own bad deeds. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.